I'm going to show you SyncScan OBD2 scanner, but first let's open the box. In the box we have the OBD scanner itself and the USB cable. Just remember to connect to Wi-Fi and update the software before taking the OBD scanner to the car. It is very quick and simple. Now that we are inside the car, just take the cable and connect it to the OBD port on your car. It could be under the dashboard, just look for it, that's the port. Connect it and you're good to go. The OBD scanner booted up. Now we have the scan, OBD and maintenance option. We're gonna run a quick scan. You select the model of your car right here. Mine is Kia, so I'm just selecting Kia. It will detect the VIN number and you can run a health report. Right now it's scanning the whole car for error codes. It's very quick. As you can see, there was no error code for my car, but if something was wrong, it will show a red exclamation. So you can click on it and read the error code and see what's wrong with your car. I wanna show you a really cool feature if you go back to the home screen in the maintenance and services. You have lots of different options here, but when you change the oil on your car, you can come here and do the oil reset, which is very useful. And also after you change the brake pads, it's really important to come here and do a brake reset as well. It is for safety and efficiency when you replace a brake pad or mud and lots of other options as well. And of course we can go into the OBD2 function as well. Here you can check for the fault codes. You can clear the fault codes as well. And also you can check the mode six, which is really, really useful to monitor your vehicle systems to make sure they are working within the recommended limit. And you can also check the live data to monitor the health of your vehicle and view essential information in real time. You can also show each data source as graph or digital display. You can even record the screen and run reports. This scanner packs a ton of features and it's really useful. 